Hey guys, this is gonna go over how to get from tunnels to this block here. Um, so the tunnels are kind of skinny, so we need to go two by two. And also, we're in the tunnels on the lower side of this picture. Um, so essentially, these two lines are gonna go two by two, then these two, and then these two. So you can see over here who's getting paired with what. So like snare one will go with quads one, snare two will be on their own, snare three will be with like quads two. And then for the following two lines, some people will be originally paired with someone, but they'll eventually move to get into their correct spot. So these four symbols will be with the bases that they're next to here. And then once everyone's set, we'll slowly spread out into what the sets actually are. Um, and then same, since we don't have a symbol 2 and a symbol 10 anymore, at first symbol 1 and 3 will be together, 4 and 8, and then 7 and 11. And you guys will just like go to your spots and then 1, 4, and 7 will shift up. So the asterisks next to some people means that they'll have to move. So Spencer is going to give taps. Um, there'll be half note taps, so it'll just be a tap with your left foot. And then at the very front of the line will be N1 and Q1. Um, and they'll just go straight out of tunnels to their exact spot. And then same with everyone else filing in. So base 8 and symbol 5 will have to make sure that they start forming their own line instead of following 9 and 5 to their spots. So basically know what yard line you're supposed to go to, especially if you're a line leader, which is um, snare 1 and quad 1, base 8, symbol 5, symbol one um, and then symbol three just symbols one four and seven notice that originally you'll be covering these three spots and then all together you'll move forward at some point to get to your true spot and then we'll just start the drum intro